At the north end, a bunch of kayakers have reported one of their companions missing. Yellow hat and an orange vest and life jacket. Yeah, so there's two concerns at this stage. One, either the patient has fallen off his ski and he's swimming around in the treacherous conditions. The other situation would be that he's overshot Bondi and he's turned around and he's paddling into it. You know, there's a really strong southerly wind and southerly swell, and to fight against that would be an absolute nightmare. The kayakers started their journey 10 kilometres south of Bondi and haven't seen their friend for close to 45 minutes. Yeah, copy, mate. Uh, we're having a good scan now. Harry's instructs the team to send an emergency message to all lifeguards along the coastline. You utilise all your resources. Contact okay. Amber, Rema, Bronte. Obviously, tell them on the radio. You want to contact Coogee lifeguards. Ask them if they can see a ski. Kayaks and skis are easily capsized in these conditions. The best, the most defensible measure right now for us is ice. All right, so we've got assets everywhere along the coastline. A big ocean journey heading from Malabar all the way down to Bondi. You become quite vulnerable out in the open ocean. Just as the ski is being prepared for launch, a call on the police radio. We've got reports of a kayaker in distress, 200 metres offshore, then Malabar. When you're going out for a search and rescue, there's so many things that are going through your mind. You're thinking about the worst case scenario. I was potentially thinking that we'd be looking for someone floating out in the ocean. Then it is a massive threat to any ocean paddler being out in a storm cell to get hit by lightning. You just don't want to be there. Soon after passing Ben Buckler Headland, Harry's makes a sighting. Yeah, we got you. The kayaker overshot Bondi. Now to get back, he has to paddle against the powerful southerly wind. I decided to chaperone him in because I know after all these years, things go wrong. And I knew as soon as we got to the wave zone, with a large ski, that ocean ski is just going to get destroyed. in open water, big swells coming through. Mother Nature owns you. Fortunately, the situation isn't far worse. Here we go, happy ending. <laughs>